Sure, I think, I mean, there's going to be a lot of emotions in the building. He spent a long time here, did a lot of great things. Um, and he's a tremendous hockey player that, <clears throat> you know, was at a crossroads and, and, and made a decision. And, um, yeah, I, I, this fan base is, is so good that, of course, they're going to feel it, for sure. Um, you know, there's going to, I'm sure there's going to be lots of happiness and, and, you know, a little bit of sadness and, and a little bit of frustration with them. I, I, you know, I think that's what comes with, you know, a big time free agent move like that. So, um, you know, I think he's prepared for whatever is going to come his way tonight. For you, what's it like to be back here and what do you reflect on when you do come through the doors? Yeah, I, I, had a, I got nothing but good memories about this building. I was really excited to come here. Um, the, the city was awesome. Um, you know, the team was awesome. Coaching staff was great. I mean, I, I had a lot of really, really good moments that I'll never forget here. So um, for me, it's it's all positive. Eric, just, you both go to free agency. You both land in Columbus, and you both have young families. You guys are kind of going through different parts of your professional career, but just the idea that you guys are kind of going through this journey together to a degree. Yeah, yeah. No, it's it's been great. Um, I mean, I've done it a lot more than he has. So... Um, you know, just having that familiar face and going through the same situation, um, you know, has, has been really good. We live very close to each other. Our wives, you know, uh, hit it off really well last year and become have become really good friends. So, um, you know, like anybody, you know, has that friend, you're, you, you know, he's kind of the buddy you lean on. And I think it, I think it's reciprocated my way, too. What well, the wives, though, isn't it? You got stuck with him. You kind of get the blindness. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather hang out with his wife than him anyways. What role do you think you played again? Uh, I mean, that, that's a better question for him, to be honest with you. Um, you know, I, I, I'd made the decision to come here, and I, and I think, you know, if in the situation he was in, if he was planning on leaving, then having that familiar face, maybe that helped, but that'd be speculation from me, purely. You, you didn't lobby him at all once you signed? <laughs> no. You know, hard or easy in the grand scheme of things for him today. It's obviously exciting, but probably a little bit difficult. I mean, just as a friend and as a teammate, what, what do you tap him on the back, let him know you're you're there? I mean, what, what do you do today? No, I I think, you know, this is something that that is unique to him. I mean, as I said, he did he did some great things here, um, and you know, in front of a very passionate fan base, and 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 however the reaction is going to be tonight. Um, It'll be directed towards him, but he's going to have a full lineup behind him, supporting him, and, and playing hard for him. Um, you know, he's on he's on a team, and 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 he's got the boys behind him for sure. So you guys want it a little more tonight for him? Yeah, of course. Eric, do you do you prepare mentally to get booed? I know it's a weird question, but when you're in that environment, how does a guy prepare for the possibility that they'll I have a building? Oh man, I don't think I've ever been booed. Maybe maybe for something I've done, not to the level that something like, like tonight. I, I I don't know. You show up and you play. Honestly, you, you show up, you do what you're good at, um, and and you get you know you probably get a you know, a, a hyper focus towards the task at hand um, and, and just dive right into that, you know, and, and um, enjoy the game. It was, the, it was only the one year here, but it seemed like it was a pretty instant connection that you had with, with the city. Did you, did you feel that as well? Like, do you look back and see it had a pretty good connection? Even yeah, oh yeah. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I played lots of places, but, you know, Calgary stands out. To me, for sure. As I said, I, I absolutely loved it here, and they gave me a great chance to get my game back on track. And you know, we had a a, a great team last year, and and fell short. But I, I got nothing but positives, uh, positive memories of this place.